what is the sum of all the angles in a, what is the sum of the angles What is the sum of the angles in a 15 gon? That means a polygon with 15 sides. OK? Now, these are kind of simple, right? You guys kind of understand these. But now we need to kind of jump to something that has 15 sides. All right? So what I want to do, I want to look at this, is I want to look at, see what kind of patterns we can relate. All right? So what I'm going to do is on, on to the next of each one of these. I'm just going to kind of write down some information that we have. i got a nice black market here. All right, so let's go and look at the triangle. Sam, how many sides does the triangle have? Three. How many triangles does it have? How many triangles are actually inside of a triangle? One. Okay, and therefore the sum is 180, right? Now let's go and look at a quadrilateral. Um, uh, Sierra, how many, how many sides does a quadrilateral have? Four. Four, right? And how many triangles did we create out of that quadrilateral? Two. All right, you guys are getting pretty good here. Um, Oscar, on a pentagon, how many, how many sides does a pentagon have? Five. Okay. And how many triangles can we get out of this pentagon? All right, very good. Um, how many sides does a hexagon have? Six. And how many triangles are in that hexagon? All right, in case I can't throw anything by you guys. Um, six and the triangles. Now, who wants to be the money? Kale, you've been gone a couple times. All right, you got sick. OK, Kale, triangle, three sides, one triangle. Quadrilateral, four sides, two triangles. Pentagon, five sides, three triangles. Hexagon, six sides, four triangles. Do you see a pattern in what I have just written in the black? What is the pattern that you see? So it keeps on getting more and more. The one we, once we keep on adding a side, we're going to keep on adding a triangle, right? Very good. Uh, do you see a relationship between the number of sides and the number of triangles? There's a difference of two. So if I asked you a 15 gon, what do you think the side length is, or how many triangles do you think there is in a 15 gon? 13. Does that make sense? Would, would, you, would everybody agree that 13 would be a reasonable estimation of how many triangles there would be? Yes. Yes, and ladies and gentlemen, that is correct. What we have is, um, I'm not going to write the, the formula for it, but when we have the sum, or when we have our um, The sum of all of our angles is equal to n minus 2 times 180 degrees. All right? Where, no, no, Zach, 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 Zach. You need to rewrite this out. Where n is the number of sides. of your n gon. So if I say you have a 15 gon, that means you need to do 15 minus 2 and then multiply that by 180. All right? So now we can be able to determine what the, what the sum of all the angles inside of a polygon is, or inside of a um, 15 gon. All right? So I'll grab my lovely handy dandy calculator. And I'll just do 15 minus 2, we know is 13. So I do 13 times 180. 
and I get 2,340 degrees. So the sum of all the angles in a 15 gallon <coughs> is 2,340 degrees. Cool? Exciting? Good. You guys, are, guys, make sure you guys have all that written down. This is new notes.